That is Arizona Highway 87 behind me. I just followed the trail underneath it. So that puts me at the beginning of the Saddle Mountain Passage. The trail in this passage is going to take me through 5.7 miles of the Mazatzal Wilderness and I'll enter it in just about five more miles but I don't think I'll have enough time to get through all of it today so I guess I'll be camping somewhere in there tonight Almost halfway. I just hit mile 393.1, and that puts me inside the Mazatza Wilderness. And looking ahead, I think I might have found a place to camp tonight. It's going to be just above 5,000 feet in elevation at the Saddle Mountain. Trail 91 Junction, and it's just about two miles ahead. Found an established campsite one mile before where I thought I was going to camp tonight. This is at mile 394.1. Looks pretty good. Where I ended up camping last night put me at about 4,800 feet in elevation. By the end of this passage, which is just nine miles ahead, I'll be at 5,800 feet. So not that big a gain in elevation this morning, but later when I start the next passage, that's where I'll gain some more elevation. I'll break 7,000 feet. At mile 398.8, that was the end of the Mazatza Wilderness. I'll be seeing it again real soon though. Well, this is a point I've really been looking forward to. This is 400 miles on the Arizona Trail, the halfway point. That wash behind me 
it's at mile 400.6 and from what I can see it looks like that's my last good water source for the next 11 miles so I drink a liter there got a liter with me and that should be plenty to get me through it And the 16.6 mile long Saddle Mountain Passage comes to an end here at the Mazatzel Divide Trail 23 Junction.